So with Doctor Who being on air for over 50 years, there is bound to be some behind the scenes drama. This week I'm diving deep into the confidential behind the scenes area to take a look at some of the behind the scenes drama of the Hooniverse. But just a word of warning, some of these behind the scenes stories are just rumoured and not confirmed, but they are still worth discussing. This is Behind the Scenes of Doctor Who. Pearl Mackey's Rude Behaviour Pearl Mackey took on the role of the Doctor's companion in series 10 after Jenna Coleman left the show. Pearl played the role of bright and bubbly companion Bill Potts, but it is rumoured that behind the scenes Pearl wasn't all that friendly. According to some of the crew members, Pearl forgot her manners and her behaviour was described as grossly rude, and she apparently also tried to give some unrequested acting lectures to Peter Capaldi. I mean, really? Come on, he's the Doctor, don't mess with the Doctor. The Selfish Shackery According to some of the crew on Doctor Who Series 7 Part 1, Stephen Burkoff wasn't a pleasure to work with. Stephen was a guest star on Series 7's The Power of Three. He played the role of the Shackery, and even though he was literally only playing a hologram, it is said that Stephen began to refuse to act. In the original script, the Shackery was supposed to be a physical presence, not a hologram. But because Stephen refused to act, Chris Chibnall was forced to change the script up a little bit and make it that the Shakri wasn't actually there at all. It is said that Stephen completely ruined the episode's final act. A Tom Baker Love Affair During season 7 of Doctor Who, back in the classic era, Tom Baker and Lala Ward began dating. It wasn't until they were filming season 18 that their relationship began to break down and started to cause a little bit of mess on set. Even to this day, Tom and Lala record their Big Finish stories separately. The Almost Death of Ace During the filming of a water tank scene for the 7th Doctor Story Battlefield, Sophie Aldred was filming in the tank when Sylvester McCoy noticed a crack in the water tank, which could have been resulted in water going all over live wires. Sylvester had Sophie removed immediately and he pretty much saved her life. Roberts vs Capaldi Gareth Roberts is known in the Hooniverse for writing some really great Doctor Who stories, including The Shakespeare Code, The Unicorn and the Wasp, the Lodger, and Closing Time. Gareth also co-wrote Series 8's The Caretaker, and this is where the trouble happened. During the filming of The Caretaker, it is rumoured that Gareth Roberts and Peter Capaldi had a falling out. It is said that Gareth Roberts is actually quite homophobic and that he's rude on set. Allegedly, Peter Capaldi had a very bad reaction to Gareth Roberts' behaviour. Apparently, this is the reason why Gareth wasn't invited back to write for Series 9 or 10. Check out this tweet that was tweeted by Gareth Roberts in 2017. Bye Bye Colin During the Sixth Doctor's era, the BBC wanted to refresh Doctor Who, and so it was ordered for Colin Baker to be fired. When Colin had a bad reaction to this, it caused arguments behind the scenes. A little while later, Colin was offered the chance to return to film a regeneration story, but he turned it down because of how he was treated. Instead, Sylvester McCoy wore a wig and had his face covered with special effects. Colin remains the only Doctor to be fired from Doctor Who. Chris vs John with John Barrowman appearing in Series 1 of New Who, it is rumoured that Christopher Eccleston and John Barrowman did not get along on set at all. It is said that the two of them argued quite a lot. Chris's on-set drama Now, this story of behind-the-scenes drama is true, confirmed by Christopher Eccleston himself. Speaking about why he only stayed for one series, Chris said that his relationship with the showrunner, Russell T Davies, producer and co-producer began to break down during the first block of filming. Chris said that they lost trust in him, which meant that he lost trust and faith in them. It is also said that the BBC announced Chris's departure from the show without letting him know. He had agreed with the BBC to announce his departure at a particular time, and that the BBC went ahead with it anyway. According to Chris, Doctor Who almost destroyed his career. So what do you think? Is there any other behind the scenes drama that you've heard of? Let me know in the comments down below. <laughs>